Hello everyone and welcome back to Hook 'em On Health. My name is Amanda. I'm a registered dietitian nutritionist and certified personal trainer and today I'm going to show you how to make my quinoa chili. This recipe is vegan, plant-based, gluten-free, and high in fiber. Plus, it only takes about half the time to cook as a normal chili. So let's get started. To start, bring your rinsed quinoa and two cups of water up to a boil on the stove. Once boiling, cover, reduce heat to low, and simmer until all the water is absorbed and the quinoa is cooked through, or about 20 minutes. Once cooked, fluff the quinoa with a fork and set aside to cool. While the quinoa is cooking, we're going to cut up all of the vegetables we'll need for our chili. Dice your onion, chop your celery, chop your bell pepper, chop your zucchini, mince your garlic, and dice your jalapeno pepper. Make sure to separate the seeds from the jalapeno pepper as we're only going to use half of them in our chili. Then, rinse your kidney beans, black beans, and corn. Next, we're going to measure out all of the seasonings we'll need for our chili. Into a small dish, measure out one tablespoon of chili powder, one teaspoon salt, one half teaspoon ground cumin, one half teaspoon smoked paprika, one half teaspoon dried oregano, and one half teaspoon ground black pepper. Now it's time to start cooking. Heat some olive oil in a stock pot over medium-high heat. Add your onion, celery, bell pepper, and zucchini, and saute until slightly softened for about five to seven minutes. Then, add your garlic and saute until fragrant or about another 30 seconds. Once your veggies are slightly softened, add in the jalapeno pepper and half of the seeds, your crushed tomatoes, vegetable broth, and seasonings. Simmer your chili, covered, for about 15 minutes. Then, add your kidney beans, black beans, and corn, and simmer for another five minutes. Finally, add your cooked quinoa, stir, and immediately remove your chili from heat. Enjoy! If you enjoyed this video, please be sure to hit that like button. A link to the full recipe can be found in the description box below. If you try this recipe, let me know how you liked it and any changes that you make in the comments section. Want to get hooked on health? Subscribe to Hook'em on Health here on YouTube and follow me on my other social media accounts. Thanks so much for watching and I'll see you all back here again next time.